Welcome. In front of me is a Samsung Galaxy Fold and today I'll show you how to set up a portable hotspot. So to get started let's pull down the notification panel, extend it and let's find the hotspot toggle somewhere in here. So it looks like it's right here. Now your position of the toggle might vary so just look for it either here or on the second page. And before you toggle it on, you number one want to actually set it up so you know what the password for it is. So hold the toggle and this will take us right here. And then you have the Galaxy Fold 41, uh, that's going to be the name of the Wi-Fi. So we can tap on it, change it to, I don't know, something else. Um, like this, whatever. It, the name doesn't really matter. And from here we have password, so tap on that, change it to something that you might remember. Uh, the only thing to keep in mind, it needs to have at least 8 characters, as you can see right here. So I'm going to make mine 8 characters, there we go. Um, then tap on save and here we have also a band so by default it says, sets it to 2.4 uh, which is uh, basically usable by almost every Android that has any kind of Wi-Fi capability um, but it can go to 5 gigahertz which is uh, an improvement over the 2.4 it's gonna be faster and just overall stronger and better um, but the key thing to keep in mind not every device will support it the older device will not uh, so from a certain point manufacturers started making them better and basically if you try to connect to Wi-Fi when it's set to 5 gigahertz and you don't even see your network name that means that your device isn't supported um, so you will just go back here and change it to 2.4 and it should work then like a charm and once that's all set you can just leave here uh, again pull down the notification panel tag it alone Toggle that on and I can't because I don't have a SIM card in the device but you just tap on it it automatically enables and you can now connect your devices to it and to disable you just tap on it again and it becomes grayish and it's disabled so if you found this very helpful don't forget to hit like subscribe and thanks for watching